Hello vlog. How y'all doing? Heat. Good morning guys. Crazy. Are you feeling incepted? Um, I, it's, not, it's Wednesday. Happy Vlogmas Day 22. Um, hope you guys are having an amazing day. I'm currently at Stride. I just taught spin at seven. And um, it's absolutely freezing in here. I'm crying. It's 8.30. Um, I taught spin at seven. And I'm just moving these bikes back. So, um, yeah, it's Wednesday morning. I just taught 7 a.m. spin at the studio. I'll put in a clip. Um, it was actually so funny because this was from this morning and Kelly, who I taught with, did 12 days of Christmas as a final sprint. Oh, where is this from? As a final sprint and it was like literally so funny. So that was really fun. Um, I'm just cleaning up a little bit. And then for the holidays, um, we're going to set up a coffee bar. So I'm just gonna do that quick. I'm gonna set that up there. I'm so excited. I think I'm gonna make myself a coffee. But maybe I won't, because I, you guys know I love my cappuccinos at home. I don't know. Got the heat moving and grooving. I need to put that away. Yeah, but. Last night, it was so funny because I was here late last night, like when it was dark out, and then I came back this morning when it was still dark out. So literally in the middle of class, I felt like I've been in like pitch black darkness for like four days, honestly, is what I felt like. So today I have a lot of work that I need to catch up on because the last couple of days I feel like I've not been working like all day yesterday. I was like with my mom and grandma and last the day before I was so tired. So the work I was doing, I just never really felt like it was good work. I just felt like I was just like catching up and then I got pedicures in the middle of the day. <laughs> So cute, free coffee bar, so cutie, and I made one and it tastes delicious. Yay, so happy to be able to do this for the holidays. It's so cute, love, love, love. Hey guys, happy Vlogmas day 21. Not gonna lie, I'm starting to feel like one of the lone survivors that are finishing Vlogmas. And now she's just her own little human. I'm editing Vlogmas. Like the funnest part. I'm going to warn you now, this is probably going to be a really boring vlog because I just have a lot of work to do today. Um, like I was kind of saying earlier, the past two days I just have not really been working as much as I should be for the work that I have to do this week. So today is just a very work heavy computer day, so it's probably going to be boring vlog wise, um, but I'll still do my best to keep you entertained. Um, I'm just doing some stride admin work and then just finishing up some new products for the manifest planner. I am working on something new that's going to be released 
very soon. Um, and I also, speaking of the Manifest Planner, have the version of the Manifest Planner that you guys are getting and that's being shipped out, which I'm so freaking excited about. I have a call with my printers tomorrow that will answer some final questions that I have. So, um, yeah, that's all I'm going to say on that um, for now anyway. But can't believe it's here with the gold okay the gold really I think looks great um and it's funny because when I first asked about printing I wanted the gold coil um and they said that they were out of stock of it actually so I changed the color of the cover to be better with white but now seeing it with the gold it looks great Anyway, um, this book is so heavy. This is actually heavier than my sample that I that I have. Um, so this book is. It was shockingly how it was shocking how heavy it was, but the reason why is because the pages are just so slightly different on this one versus my sample. Um, these pages are a little bit of a different finish, and they are a thick, high, white. So each page individually weighs more and then when you put 400 together, it literally is a whole pound heavier than my sample just because the pages are just ever so slightly different. So yeah, this planner is legit no joke and you guys are starting to get them and it's so fun to like see you guys have the planner and you guys will all say the same thing. You guys are all like, this planner is no joke. Like girl, I was, I was not kidding. Like when I said like it's no joke it's not a joke to me ron i'm uploading vlogmas because obviously i started at the studio it's only 12 p.m it's noon i don't know how because i feel like this has been like the longest day of my life but it's fine um it's noon right now and i'm just getting around to vlogmas because i taught early this morning at 7 a.m so i was at the studio by like 6 40 so i didn't want to wake up like at 5 to edit this video so i was just like i'll do it after so i'm editing it now which is why it's like a little later than normal on the weekdays i just wanted to get it up asap so that no one thought i was out here missing a day i am not missing a day uh uh, uh. i have done it this far out there is no way I'm missing a freaking day. And I'm gonna be so proud of myself when I'm finished Vlogmas. Like I really will be. So anyway, I'm just uploading it now. I kind of overbooked myself tonight because my best friend, um, I told her I'd go see her. But then one of my other best friends is in town also from California. And um, she's also in town from California and her and I are supposed to hang out tonight. And then another one of my former employees that went to college is also supposed to come over tonight. So I have like three plans with three different people. So I have to cancel on two of them. It's a matter of who. Okay, it's like two o'clock now. Um, I'm gonna go have some lunch. I can't believe I only said something at 12 because I feel like I've been doing, I've been like up here for like six hours. Today also just felt like the longest day ever, but totally fine. The Jersey Housewives trailer just dropped. Of course I watched it like 10 times. I mean, obviously, I know they're always going to put out their best work because it's a trailer and you want people to be excited for the season. But I do think Jersey currently is the best franchise. I'm tired of Beverly Hills. So I'm very excited to see what comes with Jersey. Which it's so funny. Like, can you imagine if the Housewives was like real life? Like... Obviously, they put on some of it for, you know, the cameras. I also think some of it's, like, fake. Some of it's real. I don't really know what to believe. But, like, can you imagine if you actually had a friend group that, like, constantly fought and hated each other? Like, the way I just wouldn't hang out with them. You know what I mean? Like, 
It's crazy. Margaret looks amazing with her little facelift. She looks awesome. My favorite housewife though is probably Frank Catania. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's actually Joe Gorga. I'm just kidding, I'm not. I love Joe Gorga. The way I have a crush on him is not normal. Like, he's so not my type and he's so not like any guy I've ever thought has been cute. But like the way he carries himself, I'm just like so like, he's so funny, I don't know. I heart Joe Gorga. <laughs> this is so weird. So weird. <laughs> Feels so good to like use my brain. <laughs> I know that sounded probably really dumb as I said that, but like there are some days that I'm like, oh, I just need to relax. And then I typically feel worse on those days because I feel like I just don't use my brain enough. But then when I just get into like a really good like two hour work session is when I feel my best. So I need to remember this. I also need to remember to make some more egg frittatas. I'm running low. But actually, like, what am I going to do tonight? I have plans with three different people. And I can't see all three people. So, like, i got to figure this out. Why did I do that? Why did I overcommit myself? You know why? Because I thought plans would fall through. Because typically plans fall through but I'm just waiting for it to fall through still. And it hasn't. Oh my God, the way I'm like obsessed with pickled onions is just not normal. Also just found out my cousin is not coming to Christmas Eve, very upset. So it will be just me holding down the cool cousin front. Such a shame, such a, such a cross to bear. I'm also gonna have one of my um, yogurts and I'm gonna put granola on it. This is my granola, honey granola. Tomorrow is really nice because I actually don't have to leave the house tomorrow. I have one call tomorrow at five. That's with my printers. Um, so that's exciting. I should definitely go for a walk. I woke up, remember how on Monday I was like, oh, I feel tired, blah, blah. You guys had really great suggestions for me and I really appreciate it. So I woke up this morning to Instagram and I went on Instagram. Okay, say it, say it again, Tori. And Andrew Huberman was like, if you're tired, it's because of lack of sunlight viewing. And I'm like, he totally watches my Vlogmas. So I'm gonna do some sunlight viewing tomorrow, making that a priority, because it's already past 10 a.m. Okay, I have a sandwich and then I put two cookies on here. This is a molasses sugar cookie. I made these yesterday in the vlog if you guys wanna watch, they're so cutie. Kind of a family recipe, but you can also Google it, but my Gigi like did something like special anyway. And then a chocolate crinkle. And if I want more, I'm gonna eat more. I'm watching my own vlogmas that I uploaded today like a freaking psychopath. Like, am I self-absorbed? Like, sometimes I just get anxiety. Like, I post it and then I get anxiety. I'm like, oh my god, what if like, I left something in that shouldn't have been in, even though that doesn't happen. Like, it's just an intrusive thought that I have. You guys, I'm like totally checked out today. Like I swear to God, I'm freaking exhausted, exhausted. And I just like the mental capacity is done. I finished one of the digital products that I'm releasing on Monday and I posted it on my Instagram, like a little sneak peek of it. It's a manifest journal. So that's coming out Monday um, digitally. Did I already say that? I don't know. That's coming out Monday digitally. And um, I'm just like so mentally tired and physically tired. I'm really tired. My accountant was texting me. She wants me to send her some stuff. She's so nice, my accountant. 
I'm sleeping in tomorrow. I'm gonna wake up at 7.30, go for a walk. I'm really gonna prioritize sunlight. And hopefully that will help me with my tiredness. I'm just so tired. I think I'm just done today. I really do. Oh my God, I was watching my YouTube video, but I forgot that I was. And I was like, that looks like my kitchen. It is. Something I just thought about that I haven't shared. Don't know if this is random or not, but I don't, I make it a habit. At least when I'm home at the beach, this doesn't really apply, but at home, I really try to not lay in my bed during the day. Don't get me wrong, I lay down. Like right now, I'm literally walking down the steps to go lay down. But when I lay down, I do it on my couch. I really try to not lay on in my bed during the day. I just try and keep it just for the nighttime. But that's just when I'm home. When I'm at the beach, I don't have the whole house to myself. So if I wanna be alone, I go in my room and I lay down. So anyway, these are the cookies that we made yesterday. I have not tried these yet. My grandma wanted to make these. I've never had them before. They're pretty good. They definitely just taste like a cookie my grandma would want, you know what I mean? If you knew my grandma, this would make sense. I'm trying to see both Lindsay and my other friend Brisa tonight. I don't know what I'll be able to do, but all I do know is this. I'm kind of checked out for the day, if I'm being honest. And I have a pimple on my lip, which I'm sure you guys have noticed. But um, it could be from the road peptide. I hope it's not, but it could be. For believing in me and giving me the opportunity that I've always wanted. So all I want to do is agree. Okay, heading out to Lindsay's. This is my outfit. <laughs> Pajamas. What's that? A hat. Crazy, funky, junky hat. Overslept. Hair unsightly. Literally. Trying to look like Kira Knightley. You guys should have literally heard me and Lindsay try to figure out how we're getting sushi tonight. Okay, this is her box of cookies. She's gonna love it. 